I went to Texas A&M. He had such a tremendous opportunity as a successful petroleum engineering student and a promising career. He said, it's not that I'm going to do this, it's I'm being called. From my vantage point, he sacrificed so much to pursue ministry. I'm positive he didn't see it that way. After seven years of working toward this, then he finds out that the, the cancer is back. Despite his battle with cancer, he was a soldier. Father Ryan himself was a miracle. It just struck me that he wanted to be there for us Almighty as God long as he could. The Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. I so Amen. tangibly saw him become a holier person, really because he suffered. He wasn't sad about treatment. He was sad that he couldn't be a priest longer. You know, we're trying to figure out what God's will is. But for Father Ryan, that that wasn't quite enough. Being holy wasn't just discovering God's will. It wasn't just doing God's will. It was loving God's will. 